For the CircuitPython Parsec today, I wanted to show you how you can use the Circuit Playground library to make it really easy to use buttons. And those are the buttons on the Circuit Playground Blue Fruit and the Circuit Playground Express. Inside of CircuitPython, we have the Circuit Playground library that makes it really easy to use the features there with simple commands. So here in this example, what I'm going to use is this button here, button A, when I press it, I'm going to light up a red LED. The way this works is I have from the Adafruit Circuit Playground library import CP. That brings in all the commands to use the stuff that's built onto this board. Then in the main loop of the program, it's really simple. I say if the button is pressed or CP.button A is true is what's implied there, then CP.red LED is true. Otherwise, when it's false, when the button's not pressed, then the LED is false or not lit. Now you could do this even more succinctly with this line right here, uh, which means that in just three lines of code, we import the library and then we set up the while true loop. I am saying the CP red LED is equal to the value of CP dot button A. So if I save that, give it a moment to restart, loads in that whole library, which is not small. Uh, now it's ready. When I press the button here, we get the red LED. Now you can see here, this is an example of what it would look like in straight circuit Python. So it's a whole lot more code to do basically the same thing. Now I'm gonna show you a second example here where I will, let me go ahead and comment all that stuff and I'll save this while I'm explaining what's going on here. Uh, same thing, I'm gonna import the circuit playground uh, circuit, uh, sorry, I'm gonna import the circuit playground library CP then I'm going to set the cp.pixels, that's all the neopixels on the board, brightness level, film to black, turn them off. Then my main loop, same sort of thing, except this time I'm using cp button underscore A and cp button underscore B. So when A button is pressed, I'm lighting up some of these LEDs on the left here in yellow. And then when I press the B button, I'm lighting up some of these LEDs on the right in blue. I can also set up something to pay attention to if I'm pressing them both at the same time. So if A and B, then we'll fill everything with this sort of pink color. Uh, but we can go back to individual presses. And so that is how you can use the buttons on a Circuit Playground, Blue Fruit, or Express in the Circuit Playground library in CircuitPython. And that is your Circuit Python Parsec. Bloop, bloop.